Question for the big win. What does it mean for Sandown to fight one away from home? For that, there's no need for the Ah, it's a uh, first greetings to everyone. And before one goes to into the match, first one must thank the the hospitality that you gave us in Tanzania. We, we really appreciate everything. Your level of humanity, your level of kindness uh, was seen by all in Sandy and we really appreciate the sundowns. We we feel at home here with all the history attached to Tanzania and South Africa and our freedom, we really felt warm and welcomed in the environment and we, we, we want to thank you first for that. Uh, coming into the game, I think uh, we knew we were playing against a very good team, uh, but we wanted to put our first foot forward and, and force them to to defend because we, we, we did feel we We've got better conditions physically and uh, the atmosphere suits us a little bit better considering that uh, we are coming from high altitude and we are used to playing in the afternoon and they are not used to playing in the afternoon. So we, we wanted to push them and press them from the top, which I think worked because very early in the game they committed a big error uh, and we were able to capitalize on that. But uh, one must say, we were also assisted by the fact that they got a red card very early in the game, which I would want uh, my players to learn from this because I, I still believe had that defender decided to just let the goal go on, uh, they would still remain with a good number and be able to have a fighting chance in the game. But unfortunately, because we were numerically superior, I felt first half we, we took that to our heads and we did not apply ourselves fully. We, we resorted to more ball possession instead of fighting to penetrate. But uh, when we worked with, on that aspect at halftime, and thanks to all my coaches for the input and uh, the assistance that we got, even from our analysts, because second half we, we came with a purpose and we really stretched their, their defense the way we could have done even first half. But uh, in football we learn from this, these experiences. But one appreciates the fact that we got the biggest scholar in away from home. Uh, and one appreciates the kind of football that the players played on the day, the effort they put, the, the teamwork they showed, uh, the camaraderie and the very high work ethic. We really, really feel good that it was not just a good win in terms of the scoreline, but the performance was also very good. Any concern for Dennis Onyango? We, we don't think it's a, it's a very difficult or very serious uh, injury because it's just a bruise. They stepped on him. It's not like he, he twisted an ankle or anything. So we are hopeful that because we'll have a little bit of some days before the next match, uh, he will be able to help us. We don't think it's a very serious injury. When I saw him walking in the pitch even after the game, I felt a little bit better, so we are hopeful that he will be back soon. But one must also say that Kennedy came in with his experience and plucked the hole, and it never looked like we were shaky when he got in. Thank you, Coach. Thank you, Coach. Uh, I would like to wish you a safe journey back home. You want to welcome again here. Thank you. Thank you very much, and thanks once again for your hospitality. Thank you. Thank you.